Hello, my name is Laurie Kramer. Bonjour, je m'appelle uh, Pauline Bourdon. I'm Sarah Svoboda. I'm Karis Hale. These are five things. Five things. Like five items I can't live without on tour. This is my egg shaker. I take this absolutely everywhere I go. I even actually take it when we go out to wherever we end up. It's always usually in my bra or it's in my bag, wherever wherever we are. And you can, you know, like someone's got to keep the beat. It's important to keep the beat. Um, and sometimes just for random sing-alongs, the egg shaker comes out. This has been all over the world. And actually, it got, I lost it at once. I got parted with it at Brisbane Sevens. It ended up in Fiji and then it found its way back to me via a friend. So thank you, Anski, for returning my egg shaker. And then last but not least, these are, well, these are my fish shoes. A um, few different reasons that I wear these because, well, no one steals them because they they look like this. Um, I also know exactly which ones are mine really quickly. You know, everyone's got the same black heavies or the same Burks, but no one else has got these and they're really comfy. They're kind of like wearing Crocs, like they're super squishy. Yeah, I mean, I got small feet anyway. No one can really fit into them, so. But these, these are my fish shoes. One thing, again, that I'm known for on tour is always uh, being with my Frank's Red Hot Sauce. It's a hot sauce that me and my teammate Julia Shell will sometimes rotate bringing on tour because we're both um, specifically Frank's Red Hot fanatics. Whenever we go to a hotel, they'll try to um, offer us uh, Tabasco or Sriracha. Those are not okay. The only option that we want on our eggs in the morning is Frank's Red Hot Sauce. Last time we were here in New Zealand, um, me and Julia put our money together and got two massive size or jumbo size Frank's Red Hot Sauce and those traveled with us from Vancouver to Fiji to New Zealand um, to make sure that we were never going without it because you can never be sure if uh, a hotel will have it. So that's, that's my fourth item. Okay, I'll start with my Crocs. Obviously, can't live without them. We're the most days. I do love a chunky Croc. I've got chunkier Crocs, but we only had 20, three kgs and I couldn't fit them in my bag. Um, particularly, I've got a new gibbet lately because I got married in the summer. So I've got a new gibbet that says Mrs. Cumin. Um, although Hale is still my stage name in rugby, I'm officially a Cumin now. I used to say they were an ick. Um, but then I caved and got one pair, which obviously led to two, three, four. <laughs> I have like a slipper pair. Um, and then these are my newest pair but probably not my favorite pair. My favorite pair probably my chunky ones, but again, I didn't have them in my bag. Et euh, c'est vrai que j'ai une, une enfin quelque chose qui est, qui est important pour moi aussi, c'est mes, che, mes cheveux où je joue souvent les, les cheveux détachés. J'ai juste quelques quelques tresses qui me tiennent le devant, mais mais voilà, j'aime bien pouvoir toucher mes cheveux. C'est hyper important pour moi quand je joue, euh, voilà, d'être d'être libre. Et, et souvent les, les, les gens comprennent pas pourquoi je pourquoi je, je joue les cheveux détachés, mais voilà pour moi depuis toute petite je joue comme ça et Et donc voilà, du coup, j'ai pris, pris l'habitude, mais, mais voilà, mes cheveux sont hyper importants aussi dans mon quotidien et, et pour moi. Et donc du coup, à l'entraînement, je fais juste ce petit kiki et en match, j'ai les, les tresses, mais du coup, toujours cheveux lâches. Instead of one, two, three, take my hand and come with me because you look so fine that I really want to make you mine. <laughs> I have my harmonica in here.